Thank you, Sophie, for a lovely introduction, as always. <laughs> um, thank you, everyone, for coming out here. Um, it's, it's good morning for all, all the viewers in, in US. Um, the reason Showfest, Showfest is a brand new community that we're building. And it's an attempt, it's an honest attempt to take Bollywood to the next level and to give customers uh, of, of, of Bollywood entertainment to take back something which they have never imagined, um, give them the experience of live events uh, at, at a different level, take the shows of Bollywood to the level of, of Hollywood and give them the experience uh, which they have not seen, and take them, give them the, the innovative essence which they were missing. So today is what we will explore, and, and you will we'll take you through the whole product of, of what this is. Kalbai already mentioned the IT part of it. So we will take you all through the whole journey. I'm thankful to my entire team who've put in their hard time uh, throughout this whole pandemic to build this whole new, new project. And we welcome you all to the Showfest community. Thank you, everyone. Thank you so much, Anand. I know you all are waiting patiently to hear exactly what we're going to reveal today, but you know, good things come to those who wait. So now I'd like to introduce, um, okay, what are we doing here? Ah, okay. Now the, the current model of Bollywood live entertainment in North America has several layers ranging from national promoters to local promoters. Showfest restructured the model by bringing in local promoters as executive producers where they maintain their autonomy, but at the same time enjoy the support of Showfest resources in terms of technology, production, teams, and much, much more. So let me introduce you to a very talented lady who knows the entertainment industry of the US through and through. She has risen to prominence in just a couple of years, and I'd like to call on stage the executive producer of Atlanta, Mrs. Bhavna Anand, to join us on stage. Thank you, Sophie, for beautiful intro. Good evening, everyone in Mumbai. Good morning back home. I am Bhavna An, EP from Atlanta, Georgia, along with Pab Dragwa, Lakshmi Thisam, and Anil Damani. I have been associated with Bollywood concert industry for a, quite a long time. It was such a pleasure to showcasing the talent in the United States. But let me be very honest, it wasn't easy at all. It was a challenge. It was a big challenge for us. We have been through with a lot of hurdles. Keep wondering, what extra can we do to fix this? So here we are with premium upgrade from the old ways. Showfest offering you an entertainment with stunning twist, a one of a kind of concept with multiple offering. That too throughout the year. Cool now? Yes, our member subscriber wants we take care of their entertainment and needs for the whole year. Very convenient. With Showfest, you are meant to realize what we were missing in USA, which is best in class with flawless execution. Thank you. Thank you so much, Bhavna Ji. It's lovely to have you here tonight and so enthusiastic, which is what we're all feeling. We're all getting to know what this is about. Well, our next speaker could not be here with us in person, but nonetheless is an integral part of the Showfest organization. With a zeal for entertainment industry and a strong legal background, he is someone who knows how to handle adversities with unparalleled calmness. Ladies and gentlemen, let's hear it from Mr. Jim Pisoli, Executive Vice President, Compliance. I'm Jim Pasoli, the Executive Vice President of Compliance at Showfest, which is a revolutionary platform that provides its members with an experience that transcends beyond entertainment. When we talk about revolutionary, it's because Showfest provides its members with an all-encompassing entertainment package for your entire family for an entire year. We achieve that by producing high-quality events, utilizing latest technologies, and providing meaningful customer support. Showfest is comprised of a skilled, group of professionals that have been building upon long-term industry relationships to bring you this exciting endeavor. 
I take great pride in helping contribute to this project and this company and building a community of Showfest fans around the globe. We have embarked on an exciting journey together to redefine live experiences. It will be a pleasure to have all of you join us. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Pasoli, for all your support right from the inception of Showfest. I mean, what would we do without you? All right, well, our next speaker has built organizations from the startup phase to $350 million and has also managed $800 million P&Ls. Well recognized in the US as a strategic, high impact, action oriented and visionary sales and marketing leader. He has orchestrated successful business visions and positive transformations at companies like IBM, Pitney, Manpower, and others through innovative and creative go-to-market solutions. Ladies and gentlemen, let's welcome Mr. Snehal Shah, Executive Vice President for Sales and Marketing at Showfest. Thank you, Sophie. Hey, everyone. It's an honor to be here. It feels terrific to share Showfest today. It has been a lot of work that has gone in, and it's been over 17, 18 months of hard work that the team has put in. To just introduce Showfest, to me and to the organization, we are a professional management services company focused on media and entertainment. And we want to bring the right customer experience to the fore, and we want to build technology, as Carl pointed out, technology and solutions that really drive memberships, that drive customer experience and bring the right quality of production to the table. Again, you've seen that quote before, I'm gonna repeat that, Bollywood live entertainment with a stunning twist. And you're gonna see that in a moment. The best part about Showfest for me is that it's not just a technology or an entertainment platform, but a platform for passionately providing the Southeast Asian community globally, eventually, with an ultimate entertainment experience with high quality productions. Be presenting today. Well, our next speaker has a zeal for technology and Bollywood and was not only associated with brands like Groupon and Motorola, but has also been an active member of the Bollywood live event organizations in the US. Let's hear it from Mr. Gaurav Tuteja. He's the Executive Vice President of Technology at Showfest. At Showfest. We have been dreaming of today for such a long time. And now that it's here, I don't have the words to express how I feel. It has been a long journey from the initial thought to the final execution of the Showfest website and applications. As it said, technology is best when it brings people together. And here at Showfest, we are dedicated to building a strong community. As a Bollywood lover residing in the US, I have been an audience and I have also been an organizer for several live events. I'm aware of the challenges extremely well. When I was introduced to Showfest by Carl and Anand, I immediately related to all their issues and wanted to be a part of the solution. They had penned down every problem that I had faced as an audience and as an organizer. We hear from someone who's multifaceted and has experience that ranges from the hospitality industry to fashion. As the director of venue operations at Showfest, yep, we have one of those as well, she's determined to provide the best viewing experience for everyone associated with Showfest. Ladies and gentlemen, let me please introduce you to Mrs. Ananda Kripa. Uh, and I'm director of venue operations for Showfest. I have over 15 years of experience in the hospitality and event industry, and I can say one thing stands for sure. Bollywood has such a huge impact on people's hearts. To celebrate our fantastic lineup and our prominent venues is exciting as well as a big responsibility. I love my Showfest team. We structure and strive to create a bold new look for our live experiences. Now that we know the reason behind the creation of Showfest and we've met some of the integral team members of the organization, it's evident that we really want to know how Showfest is the future of Bollywood live entertainment. 
Now, like I said, it's a build-up, and it's actually, I have the best view because I can see so many of my amazing artist friends here already tonight, which we shall reveal to the audiences watching at home very shortly. But before that, I think it's time I introduce the gentlemen who are really behind Showfest, who've worked so hard to make this happen. So I'd like to invite both Mr. Karl Kalra and Mr. I don't, I can't call you Mr. Dabra, you're my very dear friend, and Anand, founders and managing partners to join me on stage because honestly, I'm dying to know exactly what Showfest is about and I have tons of questions which I'm sure you do as well. So, guys, are you ready to join me on stage? Okay, now, who in the audience, actually, and I know this is a lot of my friends here, who in the audience has been missing live shows? Who has been missing going to concerts? I'm expecting all of you to put your hands up. Yeah, and my musician friends to have like two hands up. Yeah, because I know that uh, while I've had so much free time in the pandemic, I've been going through my iPhone gallery, not a promotion, but genuinely trying to delete things. And I keep seeing show clips of concerts I've been to be it Beyonce, be it whatever, of me performing on stage, and I have missed it like crazy. So that's one of the reasons I'm here today, because I'm so excited to know about the future of live entertainment. Gentlemen, will you join me on stage, please? Zara, zordar taliyan honi chahiye because these are gentlemen who've really worked to make this vision come true. Lekin saath hi saath ab log taliyan baja rahe hain aur soch rahe hain hum kis cheez ke liye taliyan baja rahe hain, which is why we're going to find out from them what show fest is about. So, Bollywood <laughs> entertainment live shows. <laughs> You're not giving away much. All right, let's talk about this. How did you guys come up with this concept? What did you feel was missing and what did you want to bring to the audience? So well, um, in terms of when you said that, you know, how did we come up with the concept? So as a creator of the shows, you know, we used to face a lot of challenges when we used to bring these shows to not only North America, across the world. Because there is a lot of chain, there is a lot of um, layers, as I may say. You know, there is the artist, there is the management companies, there is the show. How we can work on those pain points and come up with a solution which can ease out the whole journey right from creating the show to the delivery to the customer. So that's, that's what was driving us and that's what we've, we've tried putting our honest attempt and that's where we are today. Over here. Yeah, I mean, from what you told me, uh, while everybody was figuring out what to do with their time, you and your team were working 16 to 18 hours a day to make this happen through the entire pandemic. I wish I was on that team because it sounds like fun. And it sounds like you guys cracked the code. Am I right, Carl? Uh, you are absolutely right. You're not giving away much, I must say. You're a man of few words. Actually, actually, we want to show everybody that what we have done in the whole 18 months, when the first, actually, the sh we were starting with the Rithik Roshan show in 2020, in April. And all of a sudden, Corona came. And we have lined up so many shows. And then now, what to do? Everybody was cooking at home. <laughs> Wives are making them wash their dishes. <laughs> I hope Amit must have been had an experience like that. <laughs> no? <laughs> so, eventually after two months, we figured out that we should do something because everybody was on Zoom, everything was going on IT. So, Anand called me up and he said, hey, look, let's change this, I have an idea. I said, tell me. He said, this is the idea. I said, better you come to US. Let's talk. It was Corona, flights was not flying. Somehow he took a flight, came to Houston. Wife said, don't come home, stay out. <laughs> so I came from Chicago, <laughs> saved his life. <laughs> we shifted into a hotel, done uh, our homework. I actually quarantined for about 14 days. She also didn't let me inside the house. <laughs> yeah, that's the absolute right thing to do. But tell me, during creating this whole thing, how many flights did you take in the last one year across America? I would say, I mean, obviously we've lost the count, but nearly about 65 plus flights. Yeah, not bad during COVID time. So this is the main question which I need to ask you. What does Showfest truly offer? I mean, is it events? Is it something else? And what does technology have to do with Showfest? Okay. So Showfest, it's Bollywood, it's lifestyle, it's rewards, it's community. 
So the idea over here is to take Bollywood into the whole lifestyle. Like as, as I saw your uh, intro, what we were missing, right? So nobody can imagine today a life without the social media. People cannot ma imagine the life without, say, an Uber. It is the same thing, taxi, but the taxi has become online taxi. So the idea to infuse the technology along with the live entertainment business, the idea is to become the part of the lifestyle, part of the community, and build a new community which stays together, networks together, and we create an ecosystem which is a win-win for everyone. So that's, that's what Showfest is. ये इतने माहिर खिलाड़ी हैं अभी तक बता ही नहीं रहे हैं किसी को कि ये एक्चुअली है का है क्या इवेंट्स बोल रहे हैं टेक्नोलॉजी बोल रहे हैं थोड़ा 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 बोल रहे हैं पर आई थिंक यू हैव समथिंग दैट नाउ यू वांट टू टेक पीपल थ्रू इफ आई एम राइट ओके लेट्स गेट थ्रू टू द मेंबरशिप बुक्स सो इट इज नॉट अ रेगुलर एंटरटेनमेंट कंपनी द कस्टमर विल बिकम अ मेंबर ऑफ शोफेस्ट एंड थ्रू आउट द होल ईयर दे विल विल buy the membership just like a netflix or any other online services that they might be using and they don't need to shell out anything up front it's all per month basis and and they get a lot of membership perks throughout the whole year so the first perk is the star studded experience or the annual calendar and the customers will enjoy five live events and two huge larger than life music festivals in the venues where i don't think so any bollywood shows have ever happened which is why you also have that amazing venue director but what i want to say is you're telling me that so basically you become a member of showfest and you are promising us seven massive live events in less than a year yes so almost about 35 to 40 days i mean north america we there are there are restrictions in terms of some of the months due to the challenges of uh, snow and the heavy snow falls and stuff um, so we could only particularly months that we can we can perform in so if you leave those months out um, as you see on the screen so there's march may june july august september october actually it's october going into november as well so only months that you know we cannot put the live experience out there is december january and february this looks super impressive so you've got these seven live events aur kya hai <laughs> let's see the second so now since uh, the idea was to put the venues as the core and and pick the best venues because when you have the right venues you can give the right experience to the customer so the spots or the seats that a member will pick that seat will remain with that customer for the whole year so wait you're saying for example if i am in dallas uh and i become a member of showfest and i say mujhe a section mein row 2 seat 2 chahiye that is my seat for all seven uh, for, for 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 all five, five shows and then the two festivals yes so that seat remains with you that gets assigned to you nobody can take that seat that seat remains with you so same spot for the entire year wow the two music festivals and you can take a friend along with you for free okay impressive or let's get going <laughs> now we were asking and doing survey internally and trying to figure out um that you know somebody is coming to us for the full year right and 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 the questions may pop up that what happens say in in month of june or july i'm traveling and i cannot make it to the experience very valid so we've come up with the help of the whole itps that kalbai was mentioning right you don't need to worry about anything we've got taken care of that you can transfer that access pass to your friend and family for free so basically now you're telling me this isn't even a physical ticket this is like an app and through this app you can actually even transfer your pass yes so none of the none of the perks that comes to you as a part of a membership goes to waste so you can actually if if you cannot make it right or why do i say it that you cannot make it there are certain shows that you know your parents may want to see it or or your kids may want to enjoy it or say you want to give it out as a corporate you may want to give it out to your um 
per, perk as, as to your customers or to your own employees. You can transfer the excess passes for free. And, and it's, it's, it's like an airline uh, boarding pass. So there is no physical ticket, right? And that's where you will see some of our initiatives coming up. We are going green. Right, and we have green initiative as well connected to this. Which we're definitely going to we, be speaking We're going to talk about. about that. Yes, so you can transfer the excess passes, and nothing goes to waste, and and that's the experience. And now that you will see that you know this whole membership that you buy, it's not for you alone; it's for your whole family. Loving this. Okay, so right now we've got the seven gigs. I've got my seat fixed. I can take an extra friend, and I can transfer the pass. Mr. Kalra. 